I think it with the efficacy that we're seeing with 90 to 95 percent, I, I would I would have to believe the answer to that question is no. And and, and in reality, probably given most of our protocols, 80 percent of what we do is not even with the class three laser, which of course is what Thor is. Probably 80 percent of the treatments that um, the treatments that we actually apply um, are done with. Uh, a high energy or high power, I should say, LED device. Um, there seems to be a misconception that only class 4 laser will work. The class 4 laser has um, greater power, better penetration. A uh, reality is that much of the research right now and several of the randomly controlled studies are not even being done with laser, they're being done with LED. Uh, in a uh, um, in an experiment that was recently completed, actually they did show penetration of LED to a depth of about three centimeters, um, which uh, previous to that was felt to be only possible um, with class three and class four lasers. Um, so I think that the the argument of a class three versus a class four laser um, has been greatly overblown to a point that if someone asked me, um, if they said to me, okay, we, you have um, two laser probes or three laser probes, we're only going to let you have one to uh, achieve your treatments. Which one would you choose? I would give up the laser probe in a moment compared to um, the broad base or the broad usage that we do have of the LED. So I think in regards to the class four, class three, um, I really think it's a non-argument. I think that there has been information that's been put out um, that was not necessarily grounded on hard research. Um, I think as we go forward, we're going to see more and more and more studies um, done with lower level and not even using, um, not even using the L not even using uh, laser probes whatsoever. LED has got a far, far safer margin for error. It is impossible to burn anything with laser. It's even impossible to cause any retinal damage with an LL LED. Um, so I think as far as the, the class three or class four argument, as far as I'm concerned, it's, um, it's just fodder for, uh, um, for the marketing people.